Here we go. We're gonna be reacting to ten. All right, let me let me hold on. Let me get my headphones on. I'm gonna put the bad boys up there for now. We are reacting to ten scary videos you don't. You won't dare watch alone. I'm having a stroke right now. Uh, it's by Mind Junkie. I will put his link in the description to his channel. Let's get right into it. And uh, let's have a great reaction and a good video. Thank you, brother. All right. Ten ghosts accidentally caught on camera. The first ghost video you're about to see comes from the YouTube channel of the popular Mexican hip hop group Cartel de Santa. With over 66 million views on YouTube, this video has garnered many perceptive viewers. And right. it wasn't long before some of them started commenting about seeing something strange in the video. Watch closely. You know, I like the cowboy hat and all, but I can't. Did you catch it? Right in front of the car, a translucent figure appears before disappearing out of sight. Oh, Many nah. commenters believe that the film crew shooting this music video accidentally caught the real deal, a real ghost on camera. What do you think this is? Is it something paranormal? A little Let paranormal. Me I mean, I mean, below. it's a good ghost, but why would they add that videos, to a music video? Make sure you subscribe. Subscribe to my boy, Mind so Go ahead, do it. Go ahead, do it, go ahead, do it, brothers. Uploads. Subscribe to me. Thank you, brother. I'll show you exactly how Thank you. Yeah, um... Subscribe, sloper, and slope's reaction while I'm at it, while I'm in this video and stuff. But yeah, uh, let's get right back into it. The Haunted Manor uh, When it comes experiment. to the paranormal, Tyler Blanchard is as skeptical as one can be. He thinks that ghosts caught on camera can be explained as simple coincidences or just people imagining things. To find uh -huh. out how his friends would react when expecting to see something paranormal, Tyler comes up with a clever experiment. He splits his friends into two groups and arranges for each one to visit an empty house. The first group visits a location that- Hey chat, y'all get me to a thousand subscribers? A thousand subscribers? I'll go do a ghost hunting investigation on my main- on my second channel. I am Sloper, I will do it. I'm a man of my word. Thousand subscribers, I will do a Ghost Adventures type investigation with my friends, IRL. That is well known amongst paranormal investigators, Racken Fern Manor, located in California, USA. <laughs> the old house is notorious for being a paranormal hotspot, wherein many hauntings have supposedly taken place. Now, here's the catch. The second group visits somewhere that couldn't be more different to the first location. In fact, Tyler specifically chooses a perfectly normal house with no links to anything supernatural. I mean, I've seen... But that's not what he tells okay. his friends. He makes up a fake story about a family who passed away in the house and whose ghosts still haunt it. The experiment begins, and the first group prepares to investigate the real haunted hmm. house, oh, Rackenfern Manor. As a skeptic, Tyler isn't expecting anything paranormal to happen, but that is about to change. Ooh, with a nah. couple of torches and a music box that plays a tune whenever it senses movement, the guys descend into the cellar. Now it's calibrated. Everything that happens from this point is something going in front of it. If you're here, can you can you make the music box start? Wow. Okay. That's phenomenal. Ring the music box if it's if it's okay if we can sit down. Thank you. Let's sit down right now. Let's go. All right. Honestly, this seems I mean, so unexplainable, but not as unexplainable as the not haunted house. Is anybody here with us? All right, literally nothing was happening there. Uh, this this is weird. If you are here, would you mind turning on one of the flashlights? Or the motion sensor, whichever you prefer. You prefer the motion sensor? Uh, oh, no. Oh, both, I Candle guess. Candlelight, that's crazy. Yeah, that just doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, I wonder why. Even after positioning, it still went off. Well, thank you very much for having us. We're gonna, we're gonna go 
upstairs to this beautiful home. Please stay stay here. It's been awesome hanging out with you, uh, but we're gonna pack up our things and, and go. Thank you for this experience. I wonder if the equipment is also going on and off at the other house or if it's just going off here. Because if it's just going off here, that is pretty sus. Real, right? Like, that's crazy. I mean, that box hasn't worked at all ever, 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 ever. No. And so we it three times and then it worked every time. There's some presence moving in front of that machine. Tyler gave both groups the exact same kind of torch and music box, but only the one at Brackenfern Manor activates on its own. The music box and torches even seem to respond to the first group's questions, whereas the second group gets only silence in response to their questions. Mm. And if that isn't enough proof that Brackenfern Manor really might be as haunted as people say, Tyler's experiment is about to get even oh, creepier. Yeah. I walk past this door right here, and there's something closed in there. Which one? Let's put the box this, in there. This one. Wait, that could have that could have that could have been something, right? That could have been the air, the wind. Oh, ah, okay. Yep. Bingo, baby. Buddy scared. In the corner. Not doing this anymore. Buddy scared. In one of the bedrooms, the guys continue their investigation, but things take a scarier turn when one of the windows seems to move by itself. Yeah, I noticed the blinds moving. Activates again. It's almost as if there's someone or something we can't see moving around the room. It's John Cena. At this point, it's John the first Cena, group is freaking out, but Tyler <laughs> Buddy is determined to carry out one final test. He's looking like me when I play Fortnite scary games. Leave it silent for Speaking of that, exactly we'll look at the playlist. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Mmm. <laughs> All right, done with the Morse. Thanks for the answer. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, wow. Why you got tears in your eyes? It's a big boy. It's a beautiful moment, bro. I believe in ghosts. That is... That is beautiful. After several tests in different locations around the manor house, the music box continuously activates as if something is trying to reach out and communicate with them. And yet, the second group I have when you play with Ghost Brothers. Don't do it. Normal house get no response at all from their music box, and nothing remotely strange or paranormal happens. So, what do you think of Tyler's experiment? Did he prove that ghosts exist in that Brackenfern Manor? Really, is as haunted as people say? Leave a comment below. Gotta be, bro. Simple as that. In another ad. All right. Yeah, this is exactly what I wanted to go through today. TikTok user Emifco uploaded the next clip after he sees something creepy while chatting with two strangers online. It all starts innocently enough, with Emifco trying to guess where the two strangers are from, but then the seemingly friendly encounter takes a sinister turn. All right. Here we go. I guess something's gonna happen. Uh -huh. Hola, muchacho. ¿Cómo andan? Para yo ustedes lo conozco. Pues Argentina no. Something behind the maybe the door. Sí, yo lo conozco. ¿Vos no te llamas Javi? ¿Y vos sos Juan o no? ¿Son de España o no? Mi nombre lo pone ahí que es mi cuarto, pero. ¿Son de España o no? ¿De Madrid? Sí. Sí. Sí, sí, yo que ustedes no lo... Pero, joder, hasta la IP. Crean... Tienes nuestra IP. Eres de esos que buscan la IP y esas cosas. ¿Qué haces? Es, uh... Pero este pavo, güey. Ah, uh, bloody. ¿Me puedo hacer una pregunta? ¿Ustedes qué estaban haciendo en su casa? Pues nada. Esperar, que ahora vamos a salir de, de fiesta. Estoy solo en casa y la he invitado. ¿Solo? Sí. Solo. Bueno, con él. Llegando que está abajo. No puede ser, chicos. Yo vi que esa puerta que está enfrente se movió. ¿Cuál es esta? ¿La de Javi? Sí. Yo vi que esa puerta que está enfrente suyo se movió. Me juro que vi que esa puerta se movió.
Oh, man. Mira, mira, mira. Lo estaba tirando, ¿eh? o sea. No, have este, no, 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 yo lo vi con mis propios ojos. Yo vi que esa puerta de manera lenta se abrió y luego se cerró bruscamente, chicos. No, le intenta meter miedo, ¿eh? No, 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 no les estoy mintiendo ni por mucho menos, por favor. Yo le, le, le juro que por mis ojos, por lo que más tengo en mi vida, que esa puerta se movió. Imagine it moves again. Es imposible, no hay nada. And open up the game. Mi gato está abajo, es imposible que se mueva nada. Nos estaba tirando esto. Literalmente es el típico. Oh, no. Nah. ¿Qué le pasa? Atrás suyo hay alguien. ¿Cómo que atrás? ¡Me cago en la puta! Oh, nah. We don't know what happened. The door oh, in the background nah. appears to swing open all by itself. Emiyevko tries to warn them, but the guys say there's nobody else in the house. And when Bro one just of went them in goes there to check, he comes back a few seconds later confirming that no one else is there. Then, when the guys have their backs turned, a shadowy figure appears in the same doorway, just watching them. When the guys notice Emiyevko's terrified expression and turn to look, all hell breaks loose before the call suddenly disconnects, just like that. Emiyevko and his viewers were left confused and creeped out at what they'd just witnessed, and although the clip was posted two years ago, to this day, no one knows what happened. But what do you think? Did Emiyevko accidentally capture something supernatural on camera, or were the two guys he was chatting to playing an elaborate trick on him? Drop a comment below with what you're thinking. Oh nah. Maybe it's a prank on the dude. The, owner's office. the next creepy clip Maybe. was uploaded by Japanese but, paranormal investigator Kotatsu from the popular know. ghost hunting channel Binchu TV. Kotatsu is filming his investigation of a spooky abandoned hotel in southern Japan when something happens that shocks him to his core. According to him, the hotel has been abandoned since its former owner passed away in tragic circumstances back in 2009. Since then, the hotel has earned a reputation for being haunted, perhaps by the vengeful ghost of the previous ghost owner. Ghost Adventure R video. Through his investigation, <laughs> Kotatsu comes across the owner's old office and decides to take a break inside. However, this is exactly when things take a terrifying turn. Nah, bro. I ain't messing with this kind of video. Nah. <laughs> this one will be like behind him in that door. What hmm? nah. I dare you what? Hmm? It was a hand. Katatsu hears something coming from behind him and quickly turns around just before a pale hand appears out of nowhere. I knew the pale it, hand looks like it was about to grab him and Katatsu says that as he was turning, he caught sight of a dark, shadowy figure. So, did paranormal investigator Katatsu see the ghost of the abandoned hotel's former owner? Or is there another way to explain the creepy things he saw? And just who did this hand belong to? Share your mm. thoughts below. Alright. Horror in the basement, bro. You but don't go down in the basement. Us posted this next spooky clip on the R Perfectly Cut Streams subreddit. But the original source of the video is unknown. In the video, a group of friends are exploring what seems to be an abandoned house when they head down into the darkened basement. It a bit bigger. It's at this point that their fun better. and games turn into something much more horrifying. Is that a f***ing candle? Is that a f***ing candle? What the f*** is that thing? Oh, I want to see it. What the f***? What the sh? I can't see sh. Oh, sh. I what can't in the hell is that? Wait, hold on, turn your flashlight. What the, the boys Ooh, find a lit nah. candle in the basement 
and then something can be seen moving about in the darkness. When the kids raise their torch to try and see what's going on, their light shines on what looks like a hunched over creature coming towards them. Commenters on the Reddit post think whoever this is might be a skinwalker. But what do you think? Mm. Did the kids stumble across a supernatural creature lurking in the basement of an abandoned house? Let me know. Bro, trying to find somewhere to sleep it. Ooh, nah. Not much information is known about the following creepy video. The uploader is unknown and there is no information pertaining to the clip. But what is evident is that something truly terrifying was captured during the exploration of an abandoned building. Pay attention. Alright. So we're just gonna be exploring this random ass stuff, bro. Alright. Gotta lock in, chat. Can't get scared. Oh, I just heard a noise. Like a person? The hell is that? Oh, it moved. Gotta lock in, bro. You just wanna stand there? Now it's gone. And hey, he's gonna go inside, bro. Nah. Right, Did I, you see it? Yeah. A very faint, ghostly figure can be seen standing inside the building. But as they turn a corner and it's point gone. the camera towards where the figure had been just seconds before, there's nothing there. It's as if the figure just vanished into thin air. So, deuces, so deuces, just what exactly out. do you think this is? Is it a ghost accidentally caught on camera? Or is there another explanation? Leave a comment with your thoughts. <laughs> Goofy uh, TikTok ad. Yo, chat, let me know if you ever played these kind of games. Italian YouTuber Fancy mostly posts comedy videos and occasionally live streams himself playing video games. He's streaming one night when this something happens me. that makes him and his viewers think he might not be alone. Bene, ma direi che possiamo passare hmm. al prossimo livello di Damor. Fancy 3. Proviamo ragazzi, sono curioso di vedere quello che accadrà. Ok ragazzi, fermi un secondo. Ho sentito un rumore fortissimo, ma io sono a casa da solo. Spero sia il vento, ma non credo visto che io chiudo sempre tutto perché altrimenti ci sarebbero casini mentre registro. Oh, no, bro. No, non è possibile. Ragazzi No, adesso vi devo far vedere. No, vi giuro, raga, non è possibile. Allora, ragazzi, sono andato a controllare cosa potesse essere il rumore. Stiamo un attimo calmi. C'è la luce del bagno accesa. Vi giuro, io sono a casa da solo, non so se lo potete vedere. Stavo registrando, ho sentito il rumore della porta chiudersi e c'è la luce accesa. Raga, non sto scherzando. Allora, entro. Maybe the ghost had to go take a shower or something, bro. The sound of a door slamming startles Finksy, and when he goes to check, he finds his bathroom door has been shut and the light turned on. But he says that can't be possible because he's home alone, and he left the door open and had left the light switched off. Finksy is understandably creeped out, but he doesn't find anything suspicious in the bathroom, and his windows and doors are locked, so he heads back to his home office and tries to go back to gaming. But that's when this happens. Oh, ok no. ragazzi, rieccoci. Non so cosa sia successo all'improvviso la porta del bagno. Bro, it looks like me playing Fortnite. Ragazzi, no vabbè, giuro adesso mi sto cagando in mano però veramente. Raga, sto tremando. Sta succedendo qualcosa di strano e non sto scherzando. Ragazzi, la porta l'avevo chiusa. Raga, si poteva vedere prima che ho chiuso la porta quando sono entrato. No, raga, vi giuro. Che cavolo sta succedendo? Cioè, ha sbattuto a caso. Ma poi con quale violenza? Hmm. No, raga. No, ragazzi. Just no, swung open for no reason. Ragazzi. 
C'è la luce accesa di qua. Ragazzi, era spenta prima, l'avete potuto vedere. Sono passato da qua ed era tutto spento. No, no bro, ragazzi, something turned on the light and the bang and stuff. C'è la luce accesa qua dentro. The house. And even louder bang scares the hell out of him. And this time, when he goes to check, his bedroom door, which was previously closed, is now wide open with the light switched on. Now, like any sane person, thinks he gets creeped out and contemplates getting out of there. Then, his rocking chair starts to move all on its own. Having seen enough, thinks he quickly leaves <laughs> his apartment and heads to his car. But it doesn't end there. Thinks he had previously set up a motion sensor camera in his home office to protect his computer from theft. But instead of catching a burglar, the camera picks up something much creepier. Ooh, nah. Something that looks like a shadowy person can be seen moving around on the other side of the glass door before it eventually disappears. So just what exactly did Vince's camera pick up? Well, he claims he caught a quote ghost while recording this video and his viewers, well, they agree. But what's your verdict on this video? Did Vince <laughs> capture a ghost on camera during his live stream? Share your thoughts in the comments. Oh, hell no. <laughs> What's up with these goofy R games? Damn, but he got snatched up. Fairy or insect? It's just before dawn in Essex, England, and Lisa Nathan is letting her dog out before she gets herself ready for the day. It's something she does every morning, but this time, something happens that sends her running straight back inside. Alright, gotta go full screen for this one. The hell is that? Something can be seen flying around near Lisa before she gets scared and slaps it away. At the time, she didn't get a good look at it, but after checking the footage captured by her home security camera, she starts to think that she might have encountered a fairy. Lisa's viewers on TikTok, however, were not convinced that anything remotely supernatural had occurred. Although, whatever Lisa captured on camera certainly does look strange, commenters believe that it was probably just an insect, like a moth or a dragonfly. But what yeah. do you think this is? Did Lisa find a fairy I mean, it in could her be garden, a fairy, or but was like... it just an oh, insect no. after all? Comment below with your thoughts. Number two, the Dark Watcher. <laughs> Arabic ghost hunter Hassan from the YouTube channel Hassan Baba explores haunted locations in search of ghosts and jinns. After hearing rumors about an abandoned house that is said to be extremely haunted, Hassan decides to investigate. According to the locals, the house was previously owned by a cruel man who had several servants. It's said that after he passed away, his ghost continues to haunt the house along with the vengeful spirits of his servants. One of these spirits supposedly appears is as a shadowy figure of a woman with her face covered. Not long after her son enters the haunted oh, house, nah, things bro. You start tell me to I gotta get react creepy. to this, bro? I don't like this not one bit, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't even gonna hold you. I don't like this. أعوذ بكلمات الله التمات من شر ما خلق بسم الله الذي لا يظلم مع اسمه شيء في الأرض ولا في السماء as Hassan looks around the kitchen, a cabinet door opens and closes if something we can't see is hmm. moving it. But Hassan is about to see something much scarier. What the hell? Nah, bro. Chill out. 
As Hassan shines his flashlight through the glass window, a dark figure stands motionless, watching him from the darkness. But when he rushes round to check, the figure is no longer there. Mm -mm -mm. Hassan's viewers were left spooked by this clip, with many saying that he encountered one of the vengeful spirits said to haunt this abandoned haunted house. But what are your thoughts on this video? I don't know, bro. <laughs> والله العظيم انه في اشي موقف جوا يا اخوان وحياه الله اسمع انا بقول لكم انا بقول لكم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Brother scared can't blame him number one so this is a world of warcraft every time we do a we go from like countdowns there's always an uh, ad, every ad, every... The final creepy video for today was uploaded to TikTok by a user named Ushioni66, but the original source is unknown. The clip shows a father and son playing outside their home in Japan when something creepy happens. Don't blink or you'll miss it. Lock Sam. in. Bitch. <laughs> Mm. I'm looking. Do what? Submit it. Did you spot it? Right before the clip ends, what looks like a face of someone nah, or something bruh. can be seen for a split second staring out of one of the windows, but a second later, it's gone. Yep, then it's gone. immediately Convenient. after, a second face appears in a different window. This time, it resembles a man. Before that one just disappears as well. Now, apparently, the poster says the father didn't notice either of the creepy faces until he watched the footage back. And Ooh, it gets nah. even creepier. Because, according to him, there was no one inside the house at the time. So, if that's true, just who is this? And who is this? Nah. And where did they suddenly vanish to? You tell me. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate today. you watching. Um, shout out to Mind Junkie. Uh, buddy's at 200,000 subscribers. Trying to get like you, my boy. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hopefully, you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you thought about it. And uh, thank you for watching. And uh, you're the best.